boom. Oprah. I love Oprah. You ruined the video. I realize. So, today, this is our debate about John McCain and Barack Obama. He's on the other side. We have we have a new cameraman for the first time today. This is his first job. He's a good little doggy. So, our opening remarks is, Barack, what do you have to say about everyone saying you slept with Oprah Winfrey? Well... I just want to say that I do not have sexual relations with that woman. And I do not want you to impeach me like Bill Clinton. So, please, tell, look at Oprah. Do you think I would have slept with that? With that? That's so ugly. Why would I sleep with that? I see. And John, but what do you have to say? I slept with lots of people. My wife is an ugly piece of crap, and I sleep with ladies every night. So don't impeach me, even though I'm never going to be your president. Go, do no. Yes, that is pretty crude. Let's see some of the supporters we have in the audience today. <laughs> For John McCain, we have a pirate! Arr. We also have a rich and elegant guy. <laughs> I like tea. And we have a terrorist. Woohoo! <laughs> and then we have a Mexican guy who wants to jump the board. Hey, Anka! For Barack Obama, we have Oprah Winfrey. <laughs> we have a gay guy. I hey. love gay guys, I love Mexicans, I love terrorists, and I love pirates, and I love black people. Hey, y'all. We also have a black guy from the streets of Chicago. Yo, yo. Gee. And we have a redneck. Oh, yeah. I drink six packs of beer. I'm a redneck, and I'm proud. And I drink beer every day. That hurt. So, Obama, it is your turn to talk now. Obama Biden. What do you have to say about gay people? Well, they say in our talk duty, I like gay people. And I'm sure John McCain does too, because, you know, like, you know, like everyone loves gay people. They're just so cute and fluffy. <laughs> so, yes. And John McCain. What do you have to say about gay people? You know, I have to love gay people, considering my running mate is gay. Actually, she would be called a lesbian by some. Yes, that is all. I'm sorry, Sarah. Obama, what do you have to say in response? See, some Republicans can't like the gay people. You see? Yes. Very nice. Well, we also have a pirate in the crowd. He says, if you don't slash gas prices, <laughs> that he will eat your face and make you walk the plank. Obama. I mean, McCain, what do you have to say? I think that gas prices should be $10 a tank. I remember when I was growing up, it was only 10 cents. And I said, Mommy, why is that so much? But then I remembered that was 1910. And then I remembered that I'm old. Yes. Obama, what do you have to say? Well, as you can see, since I was already elected president, gas prices are going down, 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 down. And I slashed them. So, let me just, let's just point the camera at me. That that would be Jason here. He points the camera. Hi. Hi. So, 
I, I don't get this, Mr. Pirate, dude. Why are you voting for John McCain if you want the gas prices to be sliced? Slash. I just want to not have to pay so much gas to make my boat work. Arr. But don't boats run on, like, manpower and stuff and not, like, gas? Arr. Let's kill John McCain. No, don't throw that sword! <laughs> Bad. Keep it? Okay, good, good. Okay, the next topic we have to bring up today. Hi, you hold it. Is the Iraq War. John, what do you have to say? Well, well, I think that we should stay in Iraq and kill some old people. Because killing people is fun. Hey, what do you have to say, Barack? I think that we should get out of Iraq right now because I don't want to have to, you know, like, i sorry. <laughs> I don't think we should have to fight, because fighting is bad. What do you say, terrorist? Stay in there, I want to kill them all! <laughs> oh, well, now there's an open seat. Who wants to take it? Anyone? Tarzan. Irish people like these. Yay. So, before we leave today, actually, we have two more topics today, before we leave. The first one is for Obama, because his name is what's up right now. Obama, what do you have to say about the border from America and Mexico? I think that, 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 that our former cameraman should be helping us with this one. Uh, um, I think that the border needs to stay. Can you tell us why, cameraman? Because the border is nice. There you have it. John, why do you think we need to get rid of the border? Why do you think we need to get rid of the border? You going to say anything, John? Because I like the Mexicans. I like my fast food and I like my tacos. I love my volcano tacos. Yeah. Give me the food. P.S. Volcano tacos are only 99 cents at Taco Bell. And you got free hot sauce. Go get one. Okay. Our last topic. Mr. Mexican guy. You, you seem very happy about this. You can hop the border now. I know. I'll go hop it. Uh, Our last topic. Hey, boy. And that, that is all we have to say today. That is all that we have to say today. That I, I don't think there's anything else we have to say. But let's just wait and make sure. Just wait a couple seconds. Or not. Okay, that's all we got to say. I just want you all to know. Me and me. Shut up. Me and Randy, the cameraman, have nothing, we know absolutely nothing about politics. Oh my god, get off of him. This is public television. Oh yeah, I like it. <laughs> Me and Randy, the cameraman, must say, we know absolutely nothing about politics. Come here.